I bang punks. Watch them change up like baseball positions. I wet them up like irrigation chain pumps. You fake fucks. I blast that heater and smash your diva. These bullets will fuck up your gastrointestinal tract like lasso fever. I'm so nice, precise, rolling on, dice, I off the head, lice, did more dirt, skypes. Niggas know, when I grip the foe, my pistol like the same Figaro, Figaro. Use a little hoe, you know, a midget woman, when I peel these bullets. I'm sharp when I bust ass, I'm sharp enough to cut glass, carve potatoes. Matter of fact, peel some thin slices of skin off a tomato. I spray foes, nigga, I'm very nice. I'm roll thicker than the cellulite on the old Kelly price. This is real, what I feel. Nigga, I get it in, pure skills. Y'all motherfuckers know the drill. Black and Decker contract, kosher pickle. You know the deal. I keep it trill. So I suggest you back the fuck up, like Onyx, or you get smacked the fuck up for your chronic. My shit is so diabolic. When I pull out that ratchet and cock it and pop it, you'll find your whole crew surrounded by metal like the outfit on Dr. Robotnik. You niggas is microscopic, like looking at an amoeba. When I see ya, when I'm hungry, this ain't no Snickers commercial. I will not turn into a diva. Hmm. Y'all heard it first, man. Peter G, April 14th, Blood Sport 9, Bound for Glory. Peter God vs. That Boy Roy is going to fuck down. Got name Blood Sport 9, Bound for Glory. That dude Peter God versus that baby boy. I mean that boy Roy. You know what I'm saying? What's up, Roy? Nah, I mean, I didn't see y'all niggas doing your thing, but other than that, though, I'm out here. I'm excited. Ready to tear some heads off. Uh huh. I'm on a killing spree right now. I'm telling you. I'm just gonna shut it down, show y'all what I do, man. You know what I'm saying? What's When I battle Moosey that night, I'm gonna be honest, you know, Roller, you know, he cool guy, but he was doing some shit that I felt was not thorough at all that night, you know what I'm saying? Like, feel like he was being sarcastic and iterating, like, you know what I'm saying? As far as on Moosey's side, and if you look at the battle and like everything I'm saying, you know, he's saying his little wows and woo, but he's saying it in a way it's being funny, you know what I mean? As far as him being a headhunter nigga, Moosey was a headhunter nigga, you know what I mean? I ain't worried about that, but the thing is, I wanted to chew roller head off for him being sarcastic and funny like that just to show him that, you know what I'm saying? What the fuck was that for? You know what I mean? But it's all good though. We squash it whatever, but I just let him know straight up that night when I battled 8-11 that I won't feel in that shit. You know what I mean? I even told him, you know what I'm saying? That was some whole shit. You know what I mean? He can't, you know what I mean? Confirm this. You know what I'm saying? It's over, but that's what I said. We had some words and I told him that. You know what I'm saying? Then as far as on the internet, boy, he got a thing for always being on the computer, always on the Facebook. You know what I mean? Speaking this little piece, like, if you really look at any other battle sites, a lot of battle rappers don't do that. You know what I'm saying? So when Roy do that, you know, he, he kind of, in a sense, make the, the, the VA battle scene kind of look kind of shaky. You know what I'm saying? Make niggas look kind of, like, this what niggas do down here in VA? You know what I mean? Stay on the internet all day and chat like little females and shit. You know what I'm saying? So I just basically responded to him, leaving my words. You know what I mean? The word or through the grapevine that he said some shit. And I sounded like him, know what I mean, as far as rapping, I sounded like him when he started out rapping, like, nigga, please, know what I mean, I freestyle shit that take niggas months in advance to come up with, you know what I'm saying, like, off the thick, you don't believe me, get them go look at all three of my battles when the showtime, get that footage, and finally post it of me versus that cat illegal, you see that, that's what I do. So basically, that was the point. And when I seen Roy and Roller that night, you know what I mean, at the battle with me at 8-11, which I posed the battle Mercy Law, but he couldn't make it. Some problems happened. So I approached him, you know what I mean? Me and Roller had words, but you know what I'm saying? We ended up squashing it because we looked at it as, you know what? If we was to go at each other next, 
over some internet shit, over some battle rap shit. Two grown ass men that are really look stupid and fucked up. So I saw Roy, you know what I mean? Roy came up to me, you know, everything all peaches and cream, you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking, goddamn it, when you see each other, I thought I went at the clock, real shit, but he didn't, you know what I'm saying? He came up to me, everything was all peace, and you know, we shook hands, like, yo, Peter God, what's up, man? What? Why you come at me like that? And I told him why I came at him like that. You know what I mean? I kept it 100. And so that was the end of that. And I told him, look, and I came up the road and said, look, if I beat your brother, can I get a shot with you? And then here we go, me and Roy, April 14th. Okay. That's, That's a brief down. summary of everything that went down. Uh, what can the people expect April 14th, man, when y'all step in that ring, man? You know, you let us know the history of how this battle came to be. Like, what can we expect April 14th, man? I know you're going to try to come with some things, but I got some for his ass. People know that I freestyle, but I've been working on a new freestyle technique lately. Like, you know what I mean? As far as me just doing probably one or two rebuttals in one round, I might do some shit down there, but bottle this whole fucking round. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna come with some shit like that, flip damn near everything he said. And not, I'm really, I'm willing to take this freestyle thing to another echelon. Like, that's what you can expect from this battle. Like, you gonna see Peter Garb vocabulary stepped up, uh, that pause and shit out the way. You know what I'm saying? I done got rid of that. You know what I mean? Because I just think faster now. Because when you freestyling, you trying to say something really good, you ain't just trying to say no abby shit. You know what I mean? You know, it takes a whole lot of thought. You know what I mean? They put them brain cells to work. And I be, you know what I mean? Showing what I do. So basically, you can expect from Peter God there's a whole new PDG. The lyrics gonna be much more fierce. I'm trying to take it back to that old 90 styles of, 90 style of battle rap. You know what I'm saying? That okay. just live atmosphere. Like, you can't deny that Ass okay. um, I understand you got a battle coming up on um, Seven City Sharks. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's the 31st. And you got uh, Blood Sport April 14th. Um, also Headhunters. You got uh, that's on the 21st, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, me and Mount haven't got to sit down, but hopefully I can get that on the 21st. Okay. You know what I mean? I'm trying to hopefully I can show the 21st that they invited somebody. But most likely, Mount going to you know me see me come through there and smash somebody when he's got in the car. You know what I'm saying? Any, you know, here on the cat, I don't care. I'll take him out because, you know, blood sport for life. I fuck with Blaze. You know what I mean? He put me on. But basically, the point is. March 31st, the reason I took this, just to show cats like, anywhere, anytime, any place, I can get it in. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't matter, you know what I mean? I'm always amped and ready to go. All right, like, man, I so really y'all heard it, shit. man. April 14th, Paradigm Lounge, mm -hmm. Peter God versus that boy Roy, but before we get out of here, Pete, is there any other battles that you anticipating on seeing? Oh yeah, man. I definitely want to see DC and D Flames, man. Yeah. I really want to see that. That's the main event. Like, you know, D Flames is a veteran of head hunters. You know, I love cat. People got respect for him. And DC, one of the top notch niggas. Maybe the top notch nigga. You know what I'm saying? My man, you know what I mean? Salute to DC. And yeah, shout sport. out to DC. And that shit, and that right there should be good. And who else I want to see? Paulie Paul and Breeze. They've been going back and forth at it, you know, throwing jazz at each other for a minute. And I yeah. So basically, that battle right there between them two cats, I just really want to see them go at each other's throats like they go at each other's throats on the Facebook and all that. I just want to see that end of that. Oh, yeah, and victory and no dub. Yeah, that's going to be nice too. I want to go on to see that. Yeah.